Well, it's time for Sunday brunch, and joining us this morning is Sarah Simington from Blue Moon Cafe. Good morning. Thanks for good being morning. here. Good morning. Thank you. My pleasure. And this is a kind of a good dish if you have game day parties going on Absolutely. today. Absolutely. A little make up. spicy. A so little what something. are we cooking? We are making salsa verde. So it's a green chili. It's basically a cooked down green salsa. You can use it for huevos rancheros, but we'll talk about that later. <laughs> you can use it for breakfast nachos. You can eat it just as a stew, which I have featured here. Um, and, it, you know, it's a really nice, spicy, cold weather dish. It warms you up. It's comfort food all the way. Yeah. Well, that's what we like, comfort food. Absolutely. Let's, let's get going. So our ingredients, we have green peppers, tomatillo, jalapeno, cilantro, lemon juice, salt, cumin, and garlic. Okay. I am giving you the ingredients mm. and the potion. You have to make the magic. Okay. Every taste is subjective. It's, you know, you might want more cilantro. You might want it spicy. I like it hot, 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 so I put a lot of jalapenos. But what you want to do is with your ingredients, you need to use your Vitamix or your blender or whatever you have. Kind of pulse your ingredients and then put some of the larger things in. Okay. Throw it in your dish. Get rid of it. That one right now. Throw it around. Get it in there. I love things that you can just toss together and let them work. Let it sit. And you're going to want to cook this Mellow. for about an hour. Okay. But after you add your slurry, which we'll talk about, is cornstarch and water. It's a natural thickener. It, no preservatives, you know, so you want to make this, you're not storing it, make it and eat it. Yes. Um, not like any is going to be left over. So. No, exactly. <laughs> and then once you add your slurry, you're going to want to stand by and at least cook it down for 10 minutes at a rolling boil to kind of cook out the cornstarch and the, you know, the, the grit that the cornstarch adds. You'll, so it'll get a crystalline look to it. It'll be really delicious. You don't take any of those seeds out of those? Out I of like it spicy, <laughs> feeling hot, hot, hot. You got to add it in. And hey, it's cold outside, so this will warm you right up. Absolutely. All right, so what else do you guys have going on at the restaurant? Well, the original restaurant at 1621 Fells point we just celebrated our one year yeah congratulations i mean our 20 years I'm oh yeah sorry 20 we years just talked about that point one year in federal hill um we're getting ready to start renting out the location itself we've been using it for private events we've had a psychic medium there recently cool. we do a lot of cooking classes with chef egg which i know you guys are super yes. familiar with him he's my type buddy so, you know, we want to really utilize the space itself. Great for holidays. Yeah, events. absolutely. Holiday parties, bring people all in. All right. Well, Hi, Jen. Everybody's hungry, today. so. She's in <laughs> Ravens all the way. Yes. There you go. <laughs> the game, so I'm super stoked. Oh, God, yes. Awesome. Well, if you'd like a copy of today's recipe, you can find it on our free WBAL TV mobile app and on our website,